Welcome to Kia's Budget Life. It's your girl Kia. If you are new here, I make these type of videos every Friday and Tuesday. Friday, I stuff my main binders like sinking funds and my daily cash from my weekly paycheck. Then on Tuesday, I stuff my savings binder. It has its own video because I have so many fun savings challenges. If all this interests you and you want to watch more or follow along my budget journey, be sure to subscribe and turn on your post notifications. Hey guys, welcome, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Kia and you're watching Kia's Budget Life. This is the very first cash stuffing of March 2024 and today we'll be stuffing $595. This is going to be a really, really fun cash stuffing. I hope you guys enjoy it. If you do, please make sure you hit that thumbs up button. I do have a lot of savings challenges I'm going to be doing in this video. Um, I should have some time stamps, time stamps for you guys, so make sure you check that out. But let's go ahead and count out this money. So just for the record, these 20s in here are stuck together, so I apologize in advance. <laughs> it says 1, 2, 3, 20, 40, 60, 84, 420, 440, 460, 480, 490, 500, 10, 20, that's 45, 55, 65, 75, 576, 789, 80, 81, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 90, 591, 2, 3, 4, 5. So that is 595. All right, so let's get started with a daily cash. So gas will be getting $100. So that is just 520s. One, two, three, that's four and five. One, two, three, four, five. So that's a hundred in gas. All right. The next one I'll be stuffing is takeout, and it will be getting ten dollars. Wait, no. That's the wrong number. It has thirty dollars. I'm sorry. Thirty dollars. I just knew that wasn't right. <laughs> Takeout is getting 30. Hopefully you guys can see. I don't only film this late at night. So house is getting $10. That's the one that's getting 10. Over here looking at my notes over here. All right, and then the last one in this envelope that will be getting stuff is grocery, and it will be getting one twenty-five. So, um, yeah, I think a hundred, a hundred, a twenty, and a five. I wasn't sure if I did it in twenties, but I'm sure I did it in a hundred. All righty, and that is it for daily cash. So move on to sinking funds. My first one I'll be stuffing is my son Mason. He'll be getting five dollars. I need some new envelopes, you guys, and binders. I'm going. I'm. I'm planning on getting like a full makeover with my binders and everything. Like these are super old and just it's time to go. But my son Kobe is also getting five. <laughs> And then the last one in this binder that I'll be stuffing is the fun envelope. And this one has a savings challenge. I'll be putting in $10. So now it has 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 95, 100, 120, 125, 150, 160, 170, 180, 190, 190, 190, um worth of a block colored in so i'm gonna do a 10 and a 5 and it'll be the 45 okay so the 5 i'm doing is the l block so that's an orange and the 10 i'm doing is the s block so that's green All right, got that colored in. So that's how my Tetris is looking so far. Again, if you guys are interested, go to uh, Etsy at Sav Saves. All right, 
So um, that was it in this sinking funds binder. So we're gonna move on to my low priority sinking funds right here. The only one I'm gonna be stuffing in this one is birthdays. And I'll be putting in um, $5. And this one also has a savings challenge. So it now has 15. And birthdays. I'm gonna go ahead and put this away because that's that was the only one in um this binder I was gonna do. And I'm gonna get out the savings challenge for that one. So as y'all can see, I did have 15 in my envelope. And I only have one color in at five dollars, so I have to color in two. So I think I'm gonna stick with coloring them all the same. So I got my markers ready, so I'm gonna go ahead and color those in. You guys, I was trying so hard not to color outside the lines. I hope I did good. What y'all think? <laughs> All right, so I got those colored in. Again, if you want to get this one, this is from Etsy. Um, not sure who to, oh, make sense and grow. So if you want to get this one, make sure you get that. All right, so moving on to my holidays binder. I only have two in this one I'm a stuff. The first one's gonna be Father's Day, and I'm gonna put a dollar in there. So it now has seven dollars. And then the next one I'm gonna be stuffing. I don't know why this one there. Let me take that off. The last one I'm gonna be stuffing is Christmas, and it also will be getting a dollar. Y'all probably hear my son in the background, so. <laughs> so it's five, six, seven, eight, nine. If I would have known it was going to end up being nine, I probably would have added another dollar just to make it even. <laughs> All right, so now we're going to move on to my savings binder, you guys. So this is my savings binder. Um, if you guys remember, I used to do these videos separate, but I think I'm just including in this video for you guys. Um, so I don't know if y'all remember this little dice I got from Dollar Tree. Um, yeah, I'm not going to use it today, but say Bopley, um, if you guys are new, I play it all week, all month long, you know, four weeks in a month. So I play it four times a month. And the last time I play it, you know, that fourth week, I will play. And then everything that is in this envelope, I randomly select a sinking fund to put it in. So I do that every single month. So that's Saveopoly. This I'm going to just go ahead and show you guys um, what's in this. But I think I already showed you guys, but I'm going to show you anyway. Again. So bingo. Um will be going towards Mother's Day. It'll, it'll be a total of 161. Then I have the Money Saving Challenge. I don't think this one is on here. Yeah. So the reason why this one isn't on this dice is because I'm gonna be doing this every single um week because this is going towards my surgery I'm having in June. I'm gonna, I'm gonna put $100 in here every single week. So that's what that one is. Um, It'll total be $1,000, which is what I'm short for surgery. So the next one is a roll the dice. This is going towards Easter to be a total of 120 when I complete. And last but not least, I have the 52 weeks challenge. I don't think that was on here. Yeah, that was not on here either because this is every week as well. Um, if y'all know, y'all, if you know, you know, 52 weeks challenge. I'm not gonna be stuffing this one today because it's already um this is the 10th week of the year. So it should be a total of 50, $55 in here, and I already have that. Uh, colored in and everything so we'll do that next week and the other one on this dice I didn't show you guys is it says a hundred and that is the hundred envelopes challenge I don't know if you guys seen the binder I have for that that y'all probably have seen all over TikTok <laughs> but that will be going towards a new car it'll be you know five thousand and fifty dollars when I'm complete with that one I will show you guys that because we'll be we will be stuffing it today I just want to show you guys what was on the dice I'm not gonna be using it today all right, so like I said, um, this is going towards my surgery. This is the money savings challenge. These are really big denominations in my opinion, um, especially if you're a low income. Um, they get as high as $100. Um, the lowest I see so far is $25. Um, but if you want to get this, it is at spinningfortomorrow.com. Um, yeah, so like I said, I'm putting $100 in here every week. 
So I'm going to go ahead and take that and put it in my envelope. $100 in there. And then I think I'm not, I'm not going to actually color in a $100 piece. I'm just going to break it down to, I think I already got it marked. Yeah. I'm going to do a 35, a 35, and a 30. And I'm actually going to be using, um, I didn't really want to use a marker. I just thought I'd be different and just use a coloring pencil. And I thought I'd use green for money, honey. So let's go ahead and color this in. Okay, so if I didn't show you guys me filling this in, um, it's probably because the camera was shaking real bad. I, I noticed it was shaking real bad while I was coloring this in. So if you guys didn't see me color this in, um, I apologize. I will fix that for next time. But if you guys did see it, then it must have been okay. <laughs> but I just noticed it was shaking like really bad. So that is the money savings challenge. Um, Yeah. So the next one we're gonna do now is Safe I believe. So like I said, this will be going to a random sinking fund. So let me get the board for that. Normally I have a small one, but I have a big one this time. So let me try to, well here, let's just move this. <laughs> but we need to see the board, if anything. All right, so I have my dice and I need a place marker right here. I'm just using this paper clip. So let me go ahead and roll. So I have nine. So starting from go, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So I landed on chance. So let's go to chance. Okay, so it says roll one die, treat yourself to that amount. Okay. Let's roll a die, see what I got. Four dollars. <laughs> So I have $4, so that's gonna go towards spending. So let me get $4 out. One, two, three, four. So that's $4 going into spending. I'm just setting it to the side for right now. And that is Save Opla, you guys. I'm just gonna play it once. I'm trying to only limit myself to $10 per savings challenge I'm doing today, but I'm almost afraid to play again. Cause y'all know how, I, how I ha what happens with save out. Let's just play again. <laughs> that was just four dollars. Let's just play again. So I landed on chance, you guys. Let me just put a little paper. All right, let's play again, you guys. So I have what's that? Six. One, two, three. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. So I landed on PA Avenue, which is save three dollars. So uh, that's where I'm gonna stop at. One, two, three. I think I'm going to stop here before I continue with the savings binder because I'm trying to figure out, because all I should have now is fives and ones. And I don't know why I have all of this. Okay, so I figured out where this money goes. So I'm just put it back. I know exactly where it goes. Um, but I'm going to go ahead and do it now <laughs> before I forget. So let me put the paper clip on this one. This is where I stopped at. That's Safeopoly. So let me, the, the leftover money here is supposed to be for bills. So let me go back to that. Because bills are important. Oops, I'm sorry guys. I bumped it. Okay. Okay, so let me flip over to bills. So rent is going to be fully funded. This is rent for this month. So I'm putting in 138. Yeah, 138. 100, a 20, a 10, a 5, and three ones. One, two, three. Okay. So this should be 550. 
One, two, three, four, fifty. I meant <laughs> that fifty threw me off. One, two, three, four, four fifty, four seventy, four ninety, five ten, five thirty, five forty, five forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, fifty. So that's five fifty for rent. I knew something wasn't right over here. And in the water bill, I'm putting in 25. All right. So that's what that money was supposed to have. I was so confused. I was like, hold up now. Something ain't right. <laughs> All right. So let's continue with my savings binder. Let me move these up. Just a little. This is the one for spending. We'll put that in when we're done. Okay, so the next one I'm going to play is Bingo. So, like I said, Bingo is for Mother's Day. So, let me get that one out. Okay, so this is my Bingo. Okay, where is my black marker? Okay, here we go. Okay, so if you guys are new to Blackout Bingo, I don't fully, I don't fully know how to play, but I know, I'm, you know, for the most part, how to play. It explains it down here, but I still don't get it. It says, roll two dice and save that combination. Continue rolling and save until you reach Blackout Bingo and you save 161. I guess I'll figure it out as, as I go, but here we go. So I have five and a four. So I'm just going over five and down four. So it's five dollars. Um, I'm going to do it again because I do have, like I said, I want to do at least $10 a piece. Um, so let's do it again. So it's a four and a two. So a four and down two. Perfect. So it's $10 going into Blackout Bingo. Oh, yeah. And I do have some already in Blackout Bingo because, like I said, this is for Mother's Day. And Mother's Day... I have money already in my Mother's Day envelope, so that's six dollars there. So um I'm actually go ahead and color, not color, but I'm gonna circle just the number six for that. I forgot all about it. So uh, there we go. It's a total of five, ten, fifteen, sixteen in bingo for Mother's Day. And the next one we're going to do is roll the dice. All right, so I only need one this time. Can y'all see? Okay, six. So let me take this out. I think there's some money in here too, because like I said, this is for um Easter. Yeah, is that right? Yeah, this is for Easter. Easter has six dollars, six dollars in it as well. So that's six and six. So let me go and get the six out. I'm actually, I don't know if I want to do it a second time. Um, but let me go ahead and color in two sixes. Okay. I'm almost scared to play again because I might not do 10. <laughs> All right. Perfect. I need a four. Okay. So let me find a four and color that in. That was perfect. Okay, pull out four, one, one, two, three, four. Okay, so I have a little bit left. Okay, get my money right. So, in roll the dice so far, we should have, what's that, six, 14? No, 16. 5, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. So 16 in there so far for Easter. Hope you guys are enjoying this video so far. If you are, make sure you hit that thumbs up button. All right, next thing I was gonna do is the 100 envelopes challenge. So whatever's left over, um i was gonna put uh, put into that one so let me get the uh daily cash binder back out to put in my spending money honey 
that you know Save Opley gave me. Okay, so that's four. Ooh, look at that dollar. Ew. Okay. <laughs> Wait. I don't want that. I don't know. I just ugh. I don't want that. I let it go into that binder and stay there because it's gonna be in there for a while. So. All right, so the four dollars into spending. I can't believe I have four dollars. Four whole dollars to spend. Okay. Now we have. I'm going to just take. Wait, yeah. Remove this. See so what we got left. Five, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. So thirteen dollars. Let me get my binder. Oh, it's right in front of me. <laughs> So this is the binder. I'm sure you guys have seen this already. I get my marker for my tracker. So I have $13. I could just put it into $13. Um, I have nothing in here at all. Nothing is in here. So I could do a 1, a 2, and a 10. I, mean, I do this in so many different ways. I kind of want to do a couple of them. So... I don't really want to do the small ones though. Let's do, hmm. Let's just do two. I'm gonna do a 10 and a three. So let's do three. Think, let me try to think how I want these folded first. <laughs> okay. So I'm gonna put this in three. And I got this from TikTok too, if you guys are wondering. I think it was about five books. So we got three and we're gonna do a ten. Yeah, I think that's what we're gonna do. Um, yeah, I want it this way. I don't know what way I want to do it, you guys. No, do I want it that way? No, we will have it where the faces are kind of out there. Forgive me, y'all. <laughs> okay, so it's going into ten. This is gonna, I think this is going to be pretty. I think that's what I got in this big binder because it's going to be pretty bulky after a while. All right, so that is 10 and 3. Let's go ahead and fill that in. Right here. And right here. Perfect. So like I said, when I finish this, it'll be a total of $5,050. And I'm putting it towards a new car. So far, that is where I'm putting it's not set in stone. Um, because it's gonna be it might be a little bit before I fill this up. I'm not sure. A lot of people are doing it in a hundred days. There's a hundred envelopes are putting money in every single day, like I said, for a hundred days. Um, so people's doing it by weeks. Um, you know, if you do it by weeks, that's a good two years almost. <laughs> so yeah, so that is my hundred envelopes challenge. Let's move on to the cash jar. So this is uh, the amount of change I have for two weeks because y'all know I did not post anything last week. <laughs> so, whoa, overload, definite overload. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, make sure you hit that thumbs up button, subscribe if you haven't already, and I will talk to y'all for the very next video. Bye guys.